That's right, they sure can. And what we've got here is uh, 2012, 2013 Upper Deck Exquisite. Oh my goodness, it's Box 28. We've seen so many good things come out of here. Yes. And a lot of the guys that got in on this break uh, want to see more good things to come. I'm sure Matthew S. does. He's at the top of the list uh, of everybody that got in on the break. And Brad W., he's at the bottom. We're just going to copy that and bring it over to random.org. And you can see that, uh, once again, is confirmed uh, right there by scrolling up and down, making sure that got in there. We're going to randomize that seven times uh, and find out who gets what in our uh, Upper Deck Exquisite Collection. Uh, so good luck, everybody. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, lucky number seven. Good luck. Oh, my goodness. Uh, here it is. <laughs> Jeffrey Parker is at the top, and Brad W. is at the bottom of the list. We're going to copy that, and I'm going to see if I can dig this uh, spreadsheet up for us here. Uh, it is somewhere uh, over right. the rainbow, so uh, bear with me while I pull that uh, spreadsheet up really fast. This will... Uh it will be a good one, folks. It'll be one to remember, and I can tell you right now, uh, the stuff that comes out of here is just just phenomenal. Um, we were looking at some of the ones earlier, uh, the the Michael Jordan. There was uh, I know for a fact there's a um, Aaron pulled the Michael Jordan last night. He pulled a Magic Johnson autograph book. Um, he's pulled a, a, a lot of great stuff out of this, and he he told me too. He said, "Jay, man, this is one of those products where." Um, you can actually pull out some serious, serious cards, man. Some big cards um, with with top dollar value, man. So, uh, Flint Hero says, looking forward to watching this exquisite box break, man. Hey, you're not the oh, only yeah. one. And uh, here it is. There's our list of names that got in on it. Uh, you can see it matches right up uh, with with what we random off right there. So there's everybody with their team names beside them. Plugged into uh, the uh, exquisite plug, spreadsheet. Plugged right in uh, to the, the spreadsheet, absolutely. Uh, so, uh-oh. Uh, here we You're go. All right. Get that bigger. There you go. And there it is. Uh, so, Jeffrey P., you got the Atlanta Hawks. Michael V., got the Celtics. Jason C., Brooklyn Nets. Jason M., the Chicago Bulls. Sean M., you got the Cleveland Cavaliers. Vincent L., got the Dallas Mavericks. Felix H., got hooked up with the Nuggets. Uh, Jason S. got the Pistons. Mike B., the Warriors. Robert H., the Houston Rockets. Jason C., the Pacers, man. Vincent L., you got the Clippers. Jason S. got the Lakers. Uh, Sean M. got the Grizzlies. Carlos V., Miami Heat. Good luck, Carlos. Jason C., back-to-back. -back. Uh, Bucks and Timberwolves. Nice. So, Felix H. gets the Pelicans. Will M., the Knicks. Brad W., the Thunder. Jason C. gets hooked up with the Magic. Matthew S., you got the 76ers. Jason C. got hooked up with the Phoenix Suns. Uh, Michael K., the Trailblazers. Felix H., the Spurs. Michael V. got hooked up with the Rappers. Raptors. <laughs> Sean M., you got the Utah Jazz. What do you know? And Brad W. got the Washington Wizards. Oh, my goodness. Uh, things can change so fast, Stroker Ace. Uh, yes, they can. If you're not happy can. with your team, you can try and make a trade. Uh, I'll go ahead and show it off a little bit more here. Uh, if you want to try to wheel and deal, that's somebody's favorite team uh, somewhere. Uh, so just post it up there. Maybe somebody wants that team. Yeah. And you can always capitalize in some way, shape, or form. If you're not happy with your team, make a trade. Uh, yeah. Sell it. Uh, uh, do Anything. what you can. But you could end up pulling a monster hit anyway. Out of Exquisite Collection 2012-2013 Basketball Box 28. All right. Yeah, man. All right. So, uh, Stroke Race Kid said he's got the Nets, the Bucks, the Nuggets for trade. So, if anybody's interested in any of those teams, please let them know. Yeah, that's hey, that's no no uh no doubt. Um sometimes you do, man. You think you got a, a bad team and you end up getting some hits. I know there was a bench warmer pull the other day and a guy was like, "Ah, man, I got you." And then he ended up pulling a monster Sarah Underwood. So it was just like you you really never know, man. And <clears throat> sometimes you think, "Oh, man, you know what am I going to get?" But 
uh, you know, you'd be surprised um, what could come out of there. There's players from all over, all throughout time. So we got Stroke Race Kid saying, rip it. Is there anybody else that wants to make any trades or should we rip it? Throw me some rippets or some hold on a minute. All right, he's Kane fan saying, rip it. Oh, wow. Okay, Matt Newport News says, I need the lo- local mojo. Come on. Local mojo. Uh, uh, rip that's, it. That's where I was born and raised. <laughs> he said, Sarah Underwood is a hell of a drug. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> All right, everybody's saying rip it. Uh, so what do you oh think, Josh? We'll just go ahead and rip it. Uh, good luck, uh, Newport News. We're, we're slicing the – I just sliced all this stuff. You've seen the plastic come off. Oh, my goodness. Uh, what is going to be next? Uh, coming out of here, I've, I've never opened an exquisite box. So. All right, well, guys, hold, oh hold your uh, – there will be no trades. Camera. We're going to go ahead and open it. You want me to hold the camera for you, John? You know, I need a taller camera so it can capture this in its best ability. That's one of the few kinks uh, that will be worked out is to be able to get this uh, screen shared a little better. But uh, there it is. There Here it we is. go. All right. Okay, so we're sharing this moment together as we get into this exquisite. You never know what's going to come out of here. Hey, you can hand that to me, buddy. Sure I'll thing. take care of that. Oh my gosh! Uh, wow, e, ladies and gentlemen. All right, well here we go. Without further ado, that's right. And you can see how well this stuff is packaged. Oh yeah, that's uh, serious business. Nobody's gonna uh, mistake uh, this stuff. Uh, you can see how well sealed up it is. It's all uh, glory be. We've seen it. We we're, we're trying to get into this thing. It's the box that keeps on breaking. <laughs> it's like those uh, those dolls. You open one and there's another. You yeah. open it. What are the, the Russian something or other? But yeah, that's what it's like. And then you get to the end and it's just one little teeny, uh, like a nickel or something in there. It's like, what? Oh, my but, gosh. Oh, man. What is that? That's a Lucas. Uh, I don't know him. It's a R- Lucas Raguera. No Guerra. Oh, my gosh. And I really want to see some spurs coming out of here. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I would love to see some San Antonio Spurs. Oh, I, I'm just pulling this stuff out of here. We'll get a chance to take a close look at Oh, my gosh. Uh, this is probably not uh, your textbook exquisite break. Oh, my goodness. I've never opened this before, so I, I wouldn't normally uh, flash all these good hits. I'm going to take a look at uh, some previous exquisite breaks. Uh but man, it's too late. I've I've already started uh, with the good stuff. So this is the order we ended up showing these off, and this is probably one of the premier hits in this particular box. Uh, so uh, wow, e oh my goodness, eleven of twenty five. It is a Danny Manning. Oh, uh, we have to pull up a checklist. Or at least I do to see who Danny Manning uh, played for during his career. But you can see his college career. He played for Kansas, who went on to win uh, uh, quite a few games last year. I think they were the champs in during the NCAA last year. You, yeah, if you have to say if you want, what you what you can do is probably go ahead and pull that up, and then that way it'll save save us a lot of time, save the guys a lot of I've time. I've never broken exquisite, so I'm learning all kinds of stuff. Oh here. no, no, you're doing great. I'm just saying uh, to save them some time, yeah, fellas. Absolutely. Letting you know what we're doing, we're just pulling up the exquisite. Uh, checklist oh so that uh, you can do it. And just a little trick that I learned with this site, John, if you hit Control F, you can search teams, players, and all that instead of having to scroll all around. Little little trick. Nice card. Played for the Jayhawks, and I'm looking for a number as we go through our checklist. W- what's the name? It's LLMA is the number. That's considered the number. Right. Uh, so that that ought to be easy to find. If you uh, are. So there you go. And let me go ahead and scroll through. Uh, and we'll find out uh, with that little code right there. We'll be able to find out exactly uh, where he is at. If on the checklist if you yeah hit if you can hit control f like i said it brings you up that search menu and you can type his name in and then everything that has his name in this exquisite product will come up and then we can match it to the to the number um 
because there's not sometimes it's not necessarily in a specific order uh so that way it might um might get it in there and then you can type the fella's name in um that was a, a little tidbit ag i'm not going to take credit for that guys ag taught me that and uh so you know he's been doing this exquisite a lot this is our first exquisite break and i think it's going just fine man he goes to the clippers to the clippers oh my gosh of course nice. everything is just fine for vincent l vincent oh l. my gosh vincent l you were hooked up, my brother. Uh, wow, E, check it out, man. Uh, Vincent L., once again, want to congratulate you for this Clippers Danny Manning. Nice. 11 of 25. And what do we got here? This is a really, really nice Michael Cooper. Oh, All my right. goodness. This is a 66 of 99. Uh, absolutely beautiful card here. These cards are are beautiful, dude. You're ab you're absolutely right. I mean, they are just uh, they're just beautiful, man. I mean, the the quality of them, the the quality of the autographs. And he is a, a L.A. Lakers guy, Jason S. Uh, you pick up this lovely, beautiful uh, number to ninety nine, Michael Cooper, Jason S. Congratulations to you. And we have all oh, one of my personal favorites. This these this is Charlotte Hornet memorabilia at its finest. Oh my gosh. Wow. You got an Alonzo Morning Larry Johnson. They were huge, huge Charlotte Hornet guys. I don't know. I have to look on the checklist to see who's gonna come away with this. That's sweet. Uh, man. Charlotte Hornets is no longer uh on on the uh uh is no longer a team. Uh, so Charlotte, uh, I think uh, they ended up uh, becoming the Pelicans eventually. And so this one uh, would then who would it be? Jay? Okay, How yeah, we're it? just what we're gonna do is just pull up the checklist and they'll show us the number, and that'll be the easiest way to find it. Uh, is uh, is it the uh, go the, ahead and type it in? I believe it is. Did the, the Hornets Pelicans. become the Pelicans? I, I'll be honest with you. I don't. Uh, basketball is the one thing I don't follow a whole lot of. Um, but I don't know if it's uh, if it's going to be. I don't think it's going to be the Hornets. So, um, but anyways, let's see where it's at because I know Alonzo Morning also was on the Heat, and I think in this product they have them on the Heat. They do, don't uh, they? And who's the other guy that they have? I think that's where it's going to go. Larry Johnson. Um, so we'll, uh, we'll have to check that. So they do have the Pelicans too. Um, and then what we're looking for is what's the, uh, yeah, let's look at this exact card and see exactly. Yeah, there should be a, the letter a or whatever book. on the back. Okay. Yeah, yeah. This is one of the books and we can take a closer look. At oh this. my goodness, this, this man. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. Uh, number three of 40. We're still determining wow. who's going to walk away Look at with that. the Alonzo Morning Larry Johnson uh, combo book. Nice. And these two played together uh, for a number of years. Uh, their longest tenure was on Charlotte. Uh, we're digging into some of the I think rules. It's that is it is it this one L dash M J? There should be a code on that. Let's go ahead and look at the code, and we will determine exactly who's going to walk away. It is, in fact, L-MJ. All right. It's listed as a Pelicans card. Yes. And so that takes away the possibility of a random. Yep. That tells us who's going to get it. Felix and it, H. It's going to be Felix H., who comes away with a dual auto. Oh, my gosh. I'm a big fan of these two being from Virginia. Yeah. Uh, you have... Uh, Alonzo Morning, who's a big time local legend type of guy, mm -hmm. uh, very locally in the Hampton Roads area. Yeah, him and Allen Iverson too. Yeah, I went and saw those two play, Alonzo Morning and Larry Johnson, down in Charlotte. Yeah. Uh, so what a fabulous pool! Great and that pool. was. Let me say it again. Let me congratulate Felix H. Yes, Felix H. Wow. Great card, man. Beautiful, beautiful card. I love those because the one side's, uh, you know, white. The other side's black. But those gold, I'm just a big fan of the gold autos, man. So, so uh, we got quite a few left here to, to look through. 
And oh, uh oh, yes, it is a dual impressions. Dennis Robin. Oh man, Tony Kukok. Tony Kukoc. Yes, that is sweet, man. Rod Rodman and Kukoc, man. Oh my! Wow, gosh. two two of the big men for uh, the Chicago Bulls. Um, man, that is something there. Uh, we'll we'll double check and verify on that, but I'm pretty yeah. sure that's the Bulls, and that's going to be going out 15. to Jason M. And we're going to quickly wow uh, look for this number on the checklist. And yeah, see. we'll verify because you know this product's a little bit uh a little little uh, weird sometimes. So we always like to verify it. We want to make sure the right thing goes to the right place. John is continuing his. His streak of pulling monster hits, and uh, he's checking on that for you right now because uh, I'm wrong all the time. So we we always like to verify uh, what's going on. So we've got Dennis Rodman. Um, he is uh, he he's probably one that we can probably uh, you, you never know what to expect out of Rodman, and uh, so there you go. Um, I know it was one of those, uh, one of those right around there. I don't know what the last two letters were. Um, there it is. Yes, sir. Is that it? And yes, this is going to be the Pistons. It says Pistons. Now, what oh we need to my do? Gosh. Um, let's check. Let's type in Tony Kukoc though, real quick, because uh, Aaron said sometimes on these, not the book, uh, but sometimes on these, uh, we might have to random it because Rodman could be a Piston, but Kukoc could be a Bulls. Okay. So yeah, he was he was giving me a, a like a, a really deep lesson on this product because this is one of the harder breaks to actually do because uh, Upper Deck throws these things in here together, and like I said, we want to make sure we get it where it needs to go, uh, and we don't want to make any mistakes for you guys. So we're just gonna double check. Um, and, and we're going to see if uh, what it says for Tony Tony Kukoc, if it's even listed. Um, and there he is. He's up on here now, John. Um, so I don't think that those uh, are those letters on there. What was the, what was the code for that? 12RK. Okay, so it is. So it's listed on there, and it's it a dual is. impression, right? It's a dual impression with All two right. different teams. Uh, so that's going to get random between those two it's people. It's going to be random between the Pistons? And the Bulls. And the Bulls. And see, that's one of those weird ones where, you know, people know Rodman, of course, played for the Pistons, especially at the beginning of his career. But he but he played on the Bulls. And being that you have a Bulls guy on there with Kukoc, you would assume, like I did, hey, this is Chicago Bulls. Uh, but you can't really do a whole lot of assuming. So let's see what some of you guys are uh, – are thinking about and what we'll do is we'll random that uh at the end of the break we'll get to that random uh, as well as the other ones if there are any other yeah, ones we'll double check and see about that random but uh okay vegas Vinny, maybe it is uh we saw that uh i don't i don't think it is but if you think it is we're gonna go back so no worries we're gonna make sure this is 100 percent right okay so there's there, hold on they're saying that the uh uh, our, our chat was it was frozen or whatever. They're saying the Larry Johnson Alonzo morning is a uh, random two. So let's go back and double check that one. All right, Vegas Vinny's um, setting the, the story straight. Uh, so yes, indeed, if there are two teams uh, like you're saying there, which there I'm sure there is, yeah, then they, that will be random as well. Right now we got Jason M, who uh, has the Bulls. Right. Yeah. So he's going to go into the random with. Uh, who was the other guy? And we do uh, we do um, all the randoms at the end of the break. Uh, so don't worry. We're going to do the, the Kukoc Rodman random. Who had the other one? It's just going to take a second here, Jay. No, uh, not a problem. You said Jason M. had the one guy. and We're uh, going to go ahead and look through and find out that out exactly. It's between the Bulls and the Pistons. Okay, so that's going to be Jason, Jason M. Jason M. has the Bulls. And the Pistons are owned Jason S. So the two Jasons. Jason the two Jasons will duke that out at the end of uh, the break. And what we probably need to do is figure out who the this other one goes to. Um, That's right. So right now we have two cards that are going to be randomed off uh, at the end of the break. They're right there. So let's go ahead and move right along and see in exactly who gets what here uh, in the rest of our exquisite Wow. 
wow, we whoop de do. Uh, we're going to pull a big hit for you. <laughs> and hopefully uh, more like we've seen come out of this box of exclusives. This is Swin uh, Natter, and he was a US, uh, UCLA guy. You can see his autograph on there. This is a one of one, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Oh, my goodness. I didn't realize it the whole time. It had been sitting there right in front of us. Oh, my gosh. Nice. It is a one of one. We absolutely love to see one of ones. It's a Swin Natter. Nader. I'm not sure how to say it. So, uh, once again, we're going to refer over to Group Break Checklist. Pull that up for you and see exactly... That Nader is a Clippers guy. Clippers. Uh, so who owns the Clippers? It's none other than Vincent L. Uh, Vincent L., congratulations to you with the one of one Swin Nader. Oh, my goodness. Vegas Vinny. Uh, it's coming on fire, through. man. And what a box this has turned out to be with a wow. Robin. We've had a Dennis Robin. Oh, my gosh. It just keeps getting better and better over here. There's a Lucas Nogueira. And he has uh, played in Brazil at one time. Uh, I'm going to go nice. ahead and type in Nagara into uh, the group break checks list. And this comes up. Uh, he's a Hawks guy. All right. Oh, my goodness. Atlanta Hawks is owned by Jeffrey P. Jeffrey P., want to say congratulations to you. This is going to be FEB sending you this. Uh, Jeffrey P., wowie. And there's got to be a number on here, right? Is this, this is a rookie. Uh, so that alone adds to the value. Uh, I don't see any number on it, but it is beautiful nonetheless. All right. What a great pull, man. That is a great pull. We got a Darius Miller. This one's numbered 37 of 199, uh, Darius Miller. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Nice. <clears throat> Beautiful car. I like that auto. Nice, clean auto. Good stuff, man. Good, good stuff. All right, so here in a second, we'll get to our randoms. We're going to get this one assigned, and uh, he's a Pelicans guy. Pelicans. So there you go, Pelicans team owner, and that's Felix H. Does at least you're guaranteed a one that good one. hit. Yeah, man. Uh, number to 199. Oh, my gosh. Dennis, Darius Miller, uh, he played for Kentucky. Nice. And he's a, with the Pelicans now. Real nice. So, wow, we, we can get uh, down to the nitty-gritty yes. right now. We have two fabulous dual autographs. So, which one are we uh, random in first, John? I am finding that out, brother. Absolutely, finding that out right now. No, I was I meant what card? Yeah, what card is exactly what I'm looking at? I'm pulling up the uh, Dennis Rodman. Oh, okay, the Rodman Kukoc. And All right. yes, and that is Pistons uh, owned. Pistons and Bulls. And who owns the Pistons and Bulls? It's Jason M and Jason S. Battle of the Jasons. All right. So then again, considering you're both Jasons, uh, I guess that really wouldn't make a difference now, would it? So uh, you guys are going to duke it out, and what's going to happen if you are new, in case any of you are new, uh, the names look familiar, I don't think you're new, but just in case, or for anyone else that's in the room, what we're going to do is put the two of you uh, into random.org, uh, uh, just the two of you, and uh, we're going to hit it just like we always do, a lucky seven times, and whoever's on top after the seven times is going to be the one to walk away with the car. Oh my goodness, who's it going to be? 
uh, right after right after this we'll find out we're gonna hit it seven times good luck Jason M and Jason S and here we go one two three four five six at the top gets it seven oh it's Jason, Jason M, M. Oh my gosh! Congratulations! Oh wow! You got the Dennis Rodman uh, dual impressions. Oh, lovely autograph. Let me show you this thing one more time before it goes right into the shipping department. Oh my nice. gosh! Real, real Jason nice. Jason M, you came away with something right here. And what does that say? I can't write. It, it says I can't make that out. Yeah, I can't either. Is it a Bible verse? Is it looks like it says something work? Yeah. Worm, no, the worm, and and then whatever. The okay, other so we got two separate inscriptions. Cause you, yeah, because you know Dennis Rodman called it was was the worm. Yeah, two separate inscriptions on that. Let's see what the guys think, man. Let's see what they say. They might know exactly what it is. They're pretty good at guessing it. What do you guys say? Right, yeah, somebody said the worm. There it is, Jay. I got it on your screen. Oh, okay, cool. And uh, I've got a million screens up right a now. A million, and he's not lying either, man. The checklist is up, and we made absolutely sure uh, we did that one correctly. Now we're going to move right along. Jason M., congratulations again on the inscription. I uh, can't quite tell about that second inscription. All right. Uh, oh, somebody else is saying the Pink Panther. Yeah, I think you're right, man. The Pink Panther, that's it. All right, is there some? Is there a site on there, uh, John? Some people are saying that there's music uh, playing. If it's not an advertisement from from uh, from the Breakers TV, is it gone now? Yeah, it's one of those darn advertisements. Yeah, we had an ad popping up from Breakers TV. Sorry about that, guys. It's gone. Okay, they're saying it's gone now, John. Cool. That's fantastic because we all cannot wait to see who in the world. Yes. Uh, gets this particular book Alonzo right Morning and Larry Johnson. Wow, that's I just again, man, I love that the the black and gold on the one and the white and gold. I'm a I'm a sucker for the gold inscriptions, um, y- you know. So I, when it comes down to that, I, I really like it, um, and, and you know you can't really go wrong with that. Um, and morning is for the heat. All right. So, so we, we got the heat and then Larry Johnson. Throw an L in front of there and it'll pop up. Okay, maybe not. A couple more letters. They it had to make Larry you Johnson Pelicans. is for the Pelicans. All right. All right. So we got the Heat and the Pelicans. And who owns those two teams? You guys. Let me see. Let me find that out really quick here and set that up in random.org. Carlos V has the Heat and the Pelicans. Carlos V, you got the Heat? And the Pelicans going to be Felix H. Felix, Felix H. H and Carlos V are going to battle it out. All right. Good luck, guys. And it's going to work the same way as the last uh, random did. Both guys are going to go into random.org. Uh, the man with the atomic hand, John P., is going to hit that oh, seven times. Nice cards. You're right, Andy. Yes. Uh, there have been some good hits out of that exquisite basketball. Beautiful and, box. Uh, here it is. We're going to find out who gets this. Uh, randomize it sometimes. Here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, lucky number six, seven. Oh my gosh, it says six. Okay, so seven. Uh, Felix H., uh, you hooked up, and after randomizing seven times, you're hooked up with the very, very nice Felix Alonzo Morning Larry Johnson dual autographed booklet, three of 40. And I'd imagine with the gold ink autograph on there, if you're not Congrats, a fan Felix. of either one of these two, uh, you're gonna 
you're going to go ahead and be able to walk away with some really nice collector. This is kind of a leathery uh, dual autograph book. And so, wow, that is just awesome. Way to go, Felix. Way to go. And, guys, I would recommend uh, for uh, Jason on the uh, – um, on the the dual card, the Dennis Rodman Ku Coach card, I would definitely recommend going to fbb.com, clicking on supplies, uh, get you a magnet for that. And the same thing for you, Felix. Uh, you definitely want to get a, a magnet or a, a book magnet for your book. That's just a, a phenomenal uh, uh, book auto. Um, so you might want to get.